Hello everyone, it's me again with more videos. Today, oh, read it off my chair. Today we'll be playing some Don't Starve. I know it's an old game. I did buy it when, like a while back. I don't remember when, and never played it since. But I've heard that there's a lot of updates uh, since since this is like. Well, like, a uh, new computer and all, since when I first got this, there is no fake data, so it's more convenient for me. So... Okay, so I'm playing as... Uh, what is his name? Wilson. Yes, Wilson. I'm playing as Wilson, the gentleman scientist. Or conquered the world with power of his mind, with the beard, etc., etc. I meet you in the world. Okay, we're in here in the world. I'm not gonna do a voiceover. So, for those of you who don't know what Don't Starve is, let me just turn down the. For those of you who don't know what Don't Starve is, it's essentially a survival horror game, think about it. Like, cause like, there are horrors over the night and stuff, and then you have survival aspects, so you will just stay alive until you're able to find a way out of this world and create another world, blah blah blah. Or as far as I can tell. But I never got it for because I always died. Sorry, I just can't hear myself think because I, I left the audio for this game too loud. But like, I mean, this game is in fact um, audio based sort of thing. Because you're supposed to be able to hear sound effectively so that when something comes to murder your face, you know what is gonna, what's going to murder you. So right now, up here, I can prototype two tools for build. Axe, pickaxe, and you uh, go chop down shit. Hold down space to go and um, and get items in the, in the immediate area without having to do anything. Now this game is incredibly long, boring sometimes, at, at, at times it's boring, like in the very beginning here it's kind of boring because of how, you know, you're trying to uh, find materials to actually do things, also you have a map which is on, also you can change perspective, which I didn't know until now, so yes, you can have a map and tab. Oop, I found a rock, so I can now mine it. So let me just Now I'm trying to find some gold right now because the gold allows you to build a science machine. Which a science machine is something that allows you to build other items and stuff. For those of you who know, well then well done. For those of you who don't know, I've explained it to well now. Also, each character has their own ability. So the starting character that you would probably play as Wilson. Uh, he doesn't have any ability besides he grows a magnificent beard. And then you have uh, Willow, I believe that's her name. She's immune to fire. Her sanity goes up near fire. And also she's immune to fire. Oh, she can start a fire or whatever. 
Like when it gets dark, she just kind of light the light the fire naturally, which is kind of weird for a uh, human to do. Actually, I don't know. I haven't started the fire best by being scared myself. So as far as I can tell, that's not how it works. Now, I'm able to make a science machine. Which I will do later. I need to build a fire pit, which is a permanent sort of pit here. You can like, examine it. It's getting a bit low. Put logs into it. Or. Ah! Oh, hold on. So this is more of a, of a permanent thing. I've already built the base, some of materials. Let me just prototype a shovel. We're gonna need a shovel. Opulent pickaxe. So this is like getting prepared for said going tonight. Uh, I can make a, a garland. I'm having the flowers for that. Make another axe. I am already full on space. Where is refine? I can make cut stone. If I go over and cut this tree, I think you hear all ambient noises. So in the night it gets really eerie. It's ambient noises is supposed to like be like you're doing this. No, you're doing this now. Plant, 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 plant. Plant. This just gives the extra wood. I can now refine. I'll have to make another one. I don't want to make another one. I can now refine it. Make wood planks. I can now use it to make a sign, but that's useless. I need to make a chest. So, as you can see now, it's reaching tonight. If I get outside of the radius, I will probably die in a fire. So that's why I'm raising the fire. Cause like when it gets dark, it gets dark. So almost reaching the night here. Let me just check the settings to see if I'm able to get. Nope, that is okay. We're getting tonight. And three, two, one. It is now midnight. New moon. The moon is there because uh, when the full moon comes is when uh, a, a horde of hungry wolves comes and eats your face. When it gets dark, it gets dark, and I mean dark. So you basically just sit around here for a while. I will only show off one night though because of restrictions of the fact that I don't want to record for too long because I have other things to do. Also, you can't burn yourself. On, you cannot burn yourself on this fire, but don't be fooled by that fire. Other fires are able to be lit on so much fire. It's insane. Also, I fix fire a lot. Hmm. Okay, so the science machine, as far as I can tell, the one that you're able to do without a science machine, prototyping it with a science machine allows you to uh, build a prototype and able to build it on the fly, and like that. It's almost the dawn of a new day. Heh. <laughs> you know, I've never actually played Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. But I've heard that's what happened at the end of the game. So now I can dig up some grass tufts so I'm able to uh, get my own grass supply going over here. Grass tufts are also a very good fire fuel because they're freaking huge. Like they give you more than anything. So this is actually a good ward point because I managed to get gold very early. I managed to get everything else very early. 
and that's what you want to get things early. Not too early, because sometimes later on you run out of it, you start to get dependent on it, and then you manage to die. So I'm getting manure, so I'm able to build a farm because I have seeds right now. One seed. Uh, don't really have any food because I didn't bother to get any berry bushes. Uh, I think there's some berry bushes over here. Maybe. Maybe. Hmm. Also, this is the buffaloes or whatever. Here's a camp of. Okay. So that's a camp of pigs. They will try and defend their own stuff and things. And yeah, this game is complicated. There. Now I have my own uh, thing. I need to build a garland and I also need to get some food. Why is there basalt? The garland. Now I can, now my sanity naturally goes up. I need to find some food. I had, there's no food. That I can visibly see. It's high mandrake. Which I can eat, but that will destroy my my, my health and hunger. See look. Oh that that's a full that's a full hunger thing? Oh I've been in this in this kind of war before. Not pretty. Hold on. Dynafire. Ow. Drop something. This nighter, because it's not useful. It's not useful right now. Yeah, I just burnt down that entire forest and I don't like the forest, so I'm heading back now. Back over there. Okay, it's gonna take a while. I'm gonna need to take, keep it out for a while. Actually, I don't. So yeah, this is pretty much the entire game. It gets interesting later on, like, you find the cave, you start spelunking, you fight, you fight the bosses, you get to, uh, like, the adventure mode, the other worlds, things like that. But overall, the beginning part is kind of, well, dull. Is there more to actually do in the beginning part? Then maybe I would, you know, do the beginning part, like, for a long time, but overall it's not that interesting. Past that ends there, okay. So going up. I know. The 
did not know this. I don't know how to get rid of the thing now. No? Okay. I'm going the opposite direction of where I need to go. Apparently, due to the fact I came across a resurrection stone, I have no idea why. Oh, now my sanity is going down, fire death on faster. I might want to put the lightning rod. Anyways. Lightning rod. Two out of three gold. I'm so close though. Ah, I'm bored of this game. That's probably the reason why I kind of left it there. Anyways, that'll be it for this episode and bye.